Hello online pipe community. Ethan, Parsimonious Piper here. It is Cobb Tuesday. Got my Cobb Tuesday Cobb. Got my Cobb Tuesday hat. Today's going to be a relatively short one. I'm just going to talk about what I'm smoking. In my Missouri Mearsham Great Dane Spool, I have another bowl of Gawith Hogarth uh, Rum Flake. Now J Jamaican Flake, at least in the EU. This is classified as an aromatic. It is not, however, a Captain Black, Lane One Q, something or other cherry type aromatic with a crowd pleasing room note. No, this one, according to tobacco reviews, this one is uh, only 30% Virginia. The rest is burly and air cured, dark air cured, some such, whatever it is that Gawith uses. That makes their dark blend so delicious. Um, supposedly a maple brown sugar type casing with toppings of um, of uh, rum. Uh, the, the old tins used to say uh, licorice, uh, vanilla, something or other. I am not normally a fan of blends that have an alcohol or at least a, a liquor topping. For whatever reason, one of the exceptions to that is uh, is my my favorite Carter Hall Codger with that slight bourbon taste. But normally alcohol flavorings don't really do much for me. If you're in the same boat, give this a try. The rum on this it is very light, at least to me. It, it is not nearly as heavily uh, cased in rum as some other rum blends. Mildly sweet. The uh, the underlying tobaccos uh, really come through. Now, if you are also one of those who have shied away from the the GH or Sam Gawith uh, blends, some of them because of how strong they are, this one's a little lighter in flavor. I don't know about Nick Hit, but in flavor, this is nowhere near the uh, the brown flakes, uh, the um, uh, the dark flakes, the Irish twists, uh, ropes, the, those kinds of things. It, it, nothing close to that. Much milder, much smoother. And mostly what I taste is good tobacco. Not a lot of sweetness. You can hear one of my dogs is tanking up behind me. So I don't really classify this. I, to me, this is not really an aromatic. I mean, technically maybe it is, but it, um, it does not have that kind of sweet food flavor. It's a pretty decent blend. That said, on my scale of one to five, uh, where, where I would give this a solid three and a half to four on tobacco reviews out of their four star scale, uh, this is still a three for me because, and not because I don't like it, I do like it. But it won't replace any of the Gawith blends that I already buy, um, which are their are, are darker blends from them. In particular, the black and brown Irish twists, either in rope form or in their, their um, ribbon type cut. This is very good though. It, it, it is a very good blend. Like I said, if you if you typically shy away from rum toppings, give this a try. It, it's just barely there uh, and, and you taste what's underneath. Now this was a sample from Terry Snarf Black Piper. Thanks very much, Terry. I, I'm gonna be hitting another one of your samples. Uh, I think one of the Peretti blends coming up this next week. If you are not sub to Terry, I'm going to leave his link below since he left me this sample. Drop by, give him a sub. I think you'll like him. And while you do, light something you like. Enjoy the afternoon.